Today, science is evolving very, very rapidly. And there are so many bio-assisting devices which have come into the market or are being researched. Now, there is this concept of the artificial kidney. It's extremely interesting to know that the world of science is trying to research an artificial kidney. Today, there are so many people suffering from chronic kidney disease for which they require kidney replacement. But where do you get an organ from? It's not so easy to source an organ. Either a relative has to give it or you need cadaver donation. Therefore, science and scientists have started exploring the use of biohybrid cells actually the or the biohybrid technology actually with living kidney cells it's a fantastic idea and i'm sure this will go a long way in preventing deaths from end stage renal disorders for people who cannot source a kidney. Now, it is always thought that kidneys can be available from cadavers, but it's not so easy. To get cadaver donation is quite a difficult problem because there are so many reasons why people don't want to donate their organs. It could be religious, it could be social, it could be, uh, uh, you know, uh, the uh, environmental air, uh, people that who think that um, the donation of kidneys is not good. So therefore, there can be a variety of reasons. Hence, science has progressed to such an extent that experimental artificial kidneys are on the horizon now and with the carbon imprint and 3d imaging there is always the possibility of creating and having artificial kidneys replaced in humans there will also be such a tremendous advantage and that is the organ mismatch will not happen or the incidence of organ mismatch will be reduced and well nobody knows what is going to be the lifetime survival of such patients but at least the patient has a normal functioning though artificial kidney so something to look forward to in the years to come